Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Hardcast Commander. I am Dylan and I am today I'm joined by the usual suspects of Piper, Trent and Connor behind the camera. Hello, hello. And we have a guest, it's Jamin. Hello, that's my camera. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Jamie's from the Brisbane store. Um, you'll see him if you come along to Vault Games Brisbane. Um, you Maybe. See him around. Maybe. Yeah, sometimes. Sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. I would Either. say hopefully. I'm like a shiny Pokemon. <laughs> sometimes in, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, and today we've got a special theme. We are playing Universes Beyond. So we all have commanders that were made specifically for Universes Beyond products. Um, and yeah, we've built decks around them. Um, I don't think there's anything else. Really, can get yeah, straight into it. Yeah, I yeah. This is this is uh, a pretty can, self-explanatory. We can yeah. say hello, Connor. Everyone in the chat. Oh, hello, yeah. Connor. Everyone in the comment Connor. section, yeah. say hello, hello Connor. Connor. Uh, and if you want to support us here, don't forget to click like on the video and subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell. Get notified every time a new video goes live. Well, let's head on to the overhead and we talk about our decks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that that was the finger gun okay. thing. Yeah. That was yeah. what we were trying to write. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. As you you, you, <laughs> you know, if you watched an episode of Hot Dogs. Okay, I guess I followed it all earlier than I thought I did. Yeah. <laughs> First 10 seconds. Of <laughs> That's a great show. That's what I'm waiting for. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, today, I am playing Velikor, the Dark Master from the Chaos... The Chaos Incarnate structure deck? I don't think that's what's called. Can we get that fact checked? Yeah. Connor, what's the name of the 40k the, commander what's deck? What's the name of the Warhammer chaos? 40,000 Chaos deck. Yes. Um, he is a legendary creature, Demon Noble, that cost me three generic, a blue, black, and a red. For a 6-5 that with flying and when he enters the battlefield I draw X cards and lose X life or X is the number of demons I control. And then he also has a ability called Lord of Torment. Whenever another demon enters the battlefield under my control it deals damage equal to its power to any target. So like a War Storm Surge. It is the Ruinous Powers? Ruinous Powers. There we go, yeah. The yeah. Ruinous Powers. Thank you, you thank you, Connor. Um, Thanks, Connor. Thank you, Connor. Thanks, Connor. Say thank you, Connor, in the chat, everyone. Yeah. Um, Comments. We don't stream anymore. So well, uh, yeah, Sorry, I yeah, said it too. Sorry. I got him on the wrong end. Um, yeah. Now, a re my first like draft of the build was a bit more like just demon tribal, uh, and then Trent brought up a very interesting thing about uh, Garuda. So, thanks, Trent. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, everyone. It was like the last episode of um, Oathbreaker where I was like, about tell Beck, I was like, oh, there's a there's a companion for that. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> damn, stop giving people companions. So I am playing Gyruda, Doom of Deaths, as a companion as well. He is a legendary creature demon, demon kraken. 6-6 uh, uh, six, six for 6, so 4 and blue-black hybrid times 2. Um, my deck only has even cost cards in it, and that includes mana cost 0, by the way, because that is even. 0 um, is even. And then when he enters the battlefield, each player puts the top 4 cards of their library into their graveyard, put a creature card with an even converted mana cost from among those cards I to put under my control. So my whole deck is mainly even demons and even clones. Um, demons and even clones? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, and it's just about getting big value with Guy Rudolph and blasting everyone in the face uh, with Velcor. That's pretty much the deck. Nice. What are you playing? I'm playing, I think it's from the same structure deck. Yep. I'm, yep, playing, I'm playing Magnus the Red. He is a legendary creature demon Primarch. He is uh, three generic and is it, so red, blue. He's got flying, and he says instant and sorcery spells you ca you cast cost one less to cast for each creature token you control, and whenever Magnus the Red deals combat damage to a player, create a three three red spawn creature token. So it's quite simple. It's like spell slinging and token stampede is basically. Expels really the deck, is. really. Expels the deck, yeah. Mm. Expel because yeah, you you get to you get to reduce the cost of X on all your X spells. Incredibly fun stuff. So yeah, it's. Pretty simple, pretty what straightforward. If, what if your X spells also generated X creatures, which then made your next X spell double the amount of X creatures you generate? I'm just saying. That could be crazy. That'd, that'd be insane. What if? Would you then replicate? Mm. <laughs> what if? That'd what be if? I'm, I'm actually really looking forward to seeing how this deck runs because your token your token space is generally like white green or green space, or green yeah. color pie. But red blue would be very interesting. It's yeah. got some stuff. It's like young pyromancer kind of effects, yeah, I assume. And yeah. like Tower and Sky Summoner as well. Yeah. Get Drake's. Third past Iconoclast from Brothers Wars, pretty cool example. Yeah. Locust God. Locust God, of course. Lo oh, yep. yeah. God. Okay. There's a lot of really cool options in here. And so. Dylan's like, actually, <laughs> hang on. Hang on, hold on. Release minute. the Gremlins. Oh <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> let you I'm gonna let you ponder on that one for a bit while we ask Jamin what he's got gone on. I'm playing Fords and Neverwinter Charlatan from the uh, Secret Lair D and D on and beyond on a Beyond among. among thieves, go watch Push Up Boots: The Last Wish, Last Wish in Cinemas. It's a good, it's a better film than the D and D film. 
Okay. Uh, <laughs> does it have a huge rod in it? It is not, but it has uh, Tenero Banderas, who I like a lot more. Oh, he's great. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Is that Pussy Boots? I know. Yeah, it is actually. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Pussy Boots is real. He's a human rogue with menace. He has ward, sacrifice a creature. He gets a uh, plus two, plus zero for each treasure token you control. And when one or more players sacrifice one or more creatures uh, only once per turn, you make a tapped treasure token. That's awesome. Yeah. So it's mono black, a uh, lot of sacrifice, a lot of treasure generation, a uh, lot of stuff that's going to die. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Pretty basic. Like that. Well, I'll get into my commander today. I don't have the commander I want to show you. I don't own the card. But uh, I am playing Bolden, Century Herdmaster. This is uh, E Honda Sumo Champion. Uh, from the Secret Lair uh, Street Fighter, which is very cool. Uh, he is a 6 mana, 0 7 mono white creature. Uh, so I am shivering in my boots that that person mono black, because that is the <laughs> antithesis of how I can play the game. Um, we'll see how things go. I don't really do well with sacrifice my creatures, but this guy says 6 mana, 0 7 human warrior. As long as it's your turn, so only during my turn, each creature assigns combat damage equal to its toughness rather than its power. That's mine and yours. Keep in mind, oh, cool. each creature. So that's a weak little Bellacore. Oh, five, five. Oh, no. Anyway, uh, he says, whenever Bolden, Sentry Herdmaster slash E Honda attacks, up to 100 target creatures, <laughs> 100, <laughs> uh, each get plus zero, plus X until end of turn, where X is the number of cards in my hand. Um, most of the good cards printed in the last three years for white say draw a card on them a bunch of times. Uh, so that's basically the whole deck. It's mono white, it makes a bunch of weenies, a bunch of tokens. Uh, it reads like it's a Toughness Matters deck. It's not. Uh, it makes a bunch of 1-1s, one and he makes them into 1-8s, and then he attacks you with a swarm of 8-8s, essentially. So it's just a kind of mono-white crater hoof, kind of, in the command zone, like a Joel Rail, but in, but like in white. Uh, very cool. Uh, so basically, that's the idea. I'm going to play cards like Esper Sentinel and, um, and I guess, other cards that draw cards uh, in white, and that's the whole deck. And then I'll attack with big creatures, if they don't all get sacrificed. I'm hoping I can make more tokens than my opponents are removing my board, so we'll see how things go. We'll see. We'll see about that. <laughs> you are playing red and you have a lot of X spells because, like, Blasphemous Act. Yeah. Yeah, kill us all. Uh, <laughs> it's going to be an interesting game. Yeah. Um, I'm going to be feeling for you, Trent. Now, I, hard cut to immediately. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so that's it. We're going to shuffle up and get into the game. We'll see you on the other side. So we're all ready to go. We're all on seven yep. for our opening hands. Pretty good. Uh, we're going to roll off so you guys first. Huh. No. Oh, didn't even call it. That's all right. Well, I wasn't going to. <laughs> it's a high three. Three to, beat. three to beat. I reckon you could beat three, right? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I paint these dice. I'll add roll bad against you. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Jamin, Jamin's on the play. Yeah. See, it's almost like I went first, right? Going second is almost the same. Good luck, have fun, everyone. Good, good luck, luck, everyone. Have fun. Have fun, have fun. Hard Except casting. for you, Trent, because you're playing Universes Within and not Universes Beyond. Okay. You're really taking out of the spirit of the game. <laughs> I knew we'd bring this up. I just don't have the card. Oh, be better. Leave me alone. I've got to be better. I'm good to go? Yeah, yeah. you're good to go, man. That was during the time when secret layers were $95 shipping to Australia. Cool. So no, I did not get the secret layer. That's true. They've, they've, they've reduced that now, I saw. That, cool. That's right. I'm going to play yeah. the Abandoned Mire. Ooh. We uh, definitely seem to be too busy shipping it out of um, half that to play Dockside Chef. Whoa, oh, good open. I'm going to pass. I thought that guy was red. All right, I'm going to draw. Oh, uh, yes, let's go. All right. Honestly, very tasty looking ramen. I know there's no eyeball in there, but good looking ramen. Yeah, yeah. I awesome. feel that. Is there really an eyeball in there? Yeah. Oh, gross. What the hell? Frost boil snarl tapped. And then I'll pass my turn. Oh, he's not going to reveal anything. This won't give us any information. Yeah. Exactly. It's like no other lands in your hand. <laughs> See, unlike unlike Dylan, I'm going to reveal an island in my hand. Ooh. Ooh. For my snarl. That is a nice is. island too. Uh, it's the. Uh, Unstable. No, I meant the the name of the snarl. Oh, oh it's a it's a frost boil snarl. Frost boil. Oh, it's the exact same <laughs> as yours. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna pass the turn. Cool. I'm gonna untap. I'm gonna draw. I'm play a swamp. That's got lasers. Tapping one. It does it's have from lasers. It's the universe is beyond. That's why. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Okay. The Necron structure. Yeah. Oh yeah. All my basic lands are Necron. Uh, Necron that's cards. That's tight. I like that. Uh, am I gonna use pass? All my basics are from the Chaos deck. Even my I'm lands are two? from the universe is beyond. The Thought Vessel. Go ahead. Wow, so ramping already. Sense, I know. In my mono white deck, you gotta be careful. I guy. actually do not abide by that. Okay. You don't have to. I'm Call gonna play a command tower. 
Untap these two. Watch Dylan's gonna ramp too. Talisman of Creativity. <sighs> right. You and me both, buddy. Now pass me Am I gonna ramp? Oh my god, I am. Wow. Let's go. <laughs> Is it Signet? Ooh. <laughs> then I'll pass. Okay, you didn't play a land, it balances out. It's all good. No, I did play a land. You know what? Fine, you ramp it. I don't like it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I'm lost in turn Dylan, order. Dylan can tap, I can tap, you can't tap. Yeah, I can't. So that's the yeah. difference. I'm just a little goober. Come on, we got. We could have converted to Soul Ring, but we chose not to. Yeah, you chose not to. I'm gonna play a Swamp. And then I'm going to hit someone. Yeah, I'm just gonna ping one at you, Dylan, and then one at you, Piper. A little on me. Yeah. All They're right. both one. That's fair. Yeah, just one. You must stand. I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna untap. I'm gonna draw. Thank God we've drawn only lands. That's brilliant. Uh, planes as well. Oh, it's all matching. This is some, some of my favorite lands in all of Magic are the Arrow Devastation lands. Is that yeah, like your new? Is that your new like subscription thing? Only lands. Only lands. <laughs> you know what? For that one, just for that, I'm gonna play the right card. I'm gonna play Loran of the Third Path. When it oh. enters the battlefield, I'm gonna destroy target artifact or enchantment. What? They can't I, even tap that one. I can't even tap this man. <laughs> Look, I had to target something. I was not gonna blow up my own. But you know, go ahead. You you have the guy root of mana. You know what I mean? That's what scares me the most. Urborg. Oh, <gasps> everything's oh a swamp. You're tapping everything's a swamp. swamp everything's now. a swamp. Everything's a swamp. swamp. Everything's a swamp. Do you know this land is a swamp? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Demir signet. You didn't, you didn't need it. Yeah, right. One. Mindstone. Oh my gosh. It's okay, you got targets when you flicker Loran, I guess. It's true. Yeah. Pass. Like when and not if. Yeah. I'm gonna but I would have Bellacorm as an elf. Yeah, that's that you was would the have issue. Out of. That's, yeah, exactly. Well, if you play a land on your next turn, bro, you'll be alright. I'm going to pay two for Sorcerer class. Ooh. Lands of the battlefield, I draw two, discard two. And you put a counter on it for its level. Right? Yes. Level. Can I have a little look at Lauren? Absolutely. I'm going to... Oh. It's pretty cool. I'm a huge fan. I don't want to discard any of these, though. I guess I will discard Canoptex Garab Swarm. Ooh, oh my gosh, okay. It's okay, we'll be able to get it back. Yeah. In your red blue deck, for yeah, sure. yeah. There's recursion. There's recursion. Archimenda, I'm sure somewhere yeah. in there. S potentially, there's just like there's a lot of really good cards here. <laughs> uh, suffering from success. Yeah, and then, and then Goblin War Party. Ooh. Oh wow! Oh, yeah, your hand must be goaded. <laughs> it's got a lot of really good stuff in it. And I'm gonna pay two for a Talisman of Creativity. Oh. Because now next turn I can do things, even if I don't draw a land. <laughs> And then I'll pass. Cool. Uh, you can cast Phyrexian Obliterator. Oh no, you can't. They're two artifacts. I'm going <laughs> to no, play a couple of coppers. <gasps> and now, thanks to Urbog, I click and tap for more than 10 mana. Actually, I was going to tap regardless. Well, yeah. That's a swap now as well. That's yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. So oh, it's four. four. Yeah, that's actually going you know positive. Yeah, everything's coming at me. Uh, I'm going to. to that to make yeah, what the hell, bro? Run. Come on, man. What the heck, Dylan? <laughs> Dylan, do you play Cabal Coppers? I didn't. Why is it just over? fixing? I like that. You know what? That's powerful. I'm gonna cast my <laughs> your command tower, my commander. I'm gonna cast Forge, never win a charlatan. He's forging. Ooh, ah, I'm forging. I'm then going to. I was deeply concerned with the number of black pips on my demons. I'm going to sack uh, Dockside Chef to Viserysia. I can describe one. Response to the trigger. Yep. I'm going to go swords you. Oh, sorry, everyone. Drop my card. So excited. I'm going to take the swords forge. In response to the trigger, so you only gain two life. But you still get a treasure. You still get a treasure. Don't worry. Oh, calm down, I'm going to scoop. <laughs> <laughs> Interaction? That's it. Am I the game? No, cool. Like so I gain two life. Two. Um, so I don't get my treasure, but I do get a scry one. You do get a treasure. I do? I just, you just don't gain four life, that's all. Because the treasure resolves after you pass. Treasure. I get a scry one. Uh, I will. I'll keep. Keep my top. And then I will just pass. 
untap draw. I'm going to play down a plaint. For two, right, I'm going to play Endless Atlas. This says, pay two and tap to draw a card. Activate only if I control three or more lands with the same name. And thank God I have three swamps. So now I can tap it and draw a card. Um, so then I'm going to... Does that make... That doesn't make the name swamp. Just no, they're planes. Swamp. They're yeah. planes. They're not really swamps. And just no, no, it's just conspiracy stuff. You never know. Yeah, You're like, what if I sack the herbal organ response? <laughs> um, and then for three, I'm going to play Blimaz, King of Oleskos. He is a 3-4 cat man. He has vigilance. When I attack, he makes a 1-1 one -one cat man. When he blocks, I make a 1-1 one -one cat man. If he's attacking, the cat man is attacking. If he blocks, the cat man is blocking. I will then go to combat, and I will attack Piper for 2 damage, just because it's vigilance and it's free. What? Well, I already blew up Dylan's artifact. I killed the commander. You know what I mean? It's only valid. Disgraceful, honestly. Continue hating Dylan. No. <laughs> Such is the hard cast tradition, though. I'm not the guest, all right? <laughs> That's fair, I'm going to pass the turn to you, Dylan. The guests have been uh, Untap my swamps. historically unfair to Dylan. Draw for turn. Keep it up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm glad I know that now. <laughs> now the attacking creature can go anywhere, but the blocking creature must be blocking the same creature he blocks. I'm just going to add that. Evolving wilds. That's a swamp. It is a swamp. That's the strat right there. Dude, I'm going to convert my swamp into an island. <laughs> that was a bad card. Uh, Bellacore. In my Urborg deck, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> In my mono black deck. I play Bellacore. Any anybody. responses? I'm playing his swords. Bellacore enters. Uh, I draw one card and lose one life because I have one demon. That's awesome, bro. Down to 38. At this rate, he'll kill himself. Good. Oh, that's the plan. Um, and then I will pass my turn. I'm going to untap, upkeep, and draw. And now maybe In that order, right? Yeah. Maybe I can do things. I will. Oh, let's go. I got a land. Wahoo. This was the other strat for Urborg that I didn't realize. Yeah. Well, that I thought about wasn't really like playing into, but if I'm already fixed, my E Wilds and my Terramorphic Expanse now don't slow me down. That's true. In the, I think it's a, in the very edge case that you can go into the exact six mana play. It's very good. It's very good. I'm going to pay five. In early in the game. Ooh. Magnus the Red. Let's go. Uh, he does nothing currently. Right now, he's just a 4 5 boy. Just very good. With flying. So. That's that's neat. That's something. I'm cool. gonna pass Unless the turn. Trent attacks, and oh. then he becomes a five. And then he's a five five. Yeah. Four things out. Sorry, Honda. E Honda. Actually, kind of like unironically scared of the herbal interaction happening here. I play a swamp. Oh shit. He's already got a lot of swamps, but having the plus two is pretty crazy. If Jamin has a cabal coffers, he has an herbal. Yeah, of course, but he doesn't have it currently, Dylan. <laughs> yeah, you just did half of it for yeah. him. Cool. That makes five. He doesn't have any much, much land searching, you know. I'm going to crack that. Okay. For six, to cast Kate's Sun. Ooh. Choosing black. Okay. Damn, really? And I'm going to tap those for two black mana each. Play a Grim Hireling. Amazing. Okay. Cool. And uh, it'll be my turn. I'm going to pass. Um, how many cards do you have in hand, Jamin? I have three. Piper? And Dylan. Five. Jamin. Yep. We're both going to draw a card. Cool. Untap. Upkeep. And I'll draw for ten. <laughs> yes. Yes. We saw him. All right. We're going to tap Thought Vessel. We're going to play Sorin. Um. Cage Sun's wild. Yeah, it's a Necron one as well. It's, yeah, it's so good. Yeah, it's from Beyond awesome? This Universe. Yeah. That's crazy. All the cards That's I can. That's the Tesseract Vault. Yeah. Look at the little Katana there. He's having a great time. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, oh, make it in. He's saying, release me. I'm in pain. The crew's like, no, no, in that language, that means I'm having a great time. <laughs> having yeah, a wonderful time. <laughs> wonderful. All right, so you have a, what, a 4 3 and a 2 2? Yeah, yeah. Um, not great. Um,. So you have four in hand now, correct? There's three now, four? Yep, four. Yeah, basic math. We can do it, we can do it. Um, Piper, you and I will draw a card. Yeah. I'll yeah. Play for turn. It'll be a haunted fen grab. This Ooh. card allows me to get creatures from, at random from my graveyard to my hand by sacrificing it. It's also a swamp. It's also a swamp. Ooh. Damn, that's powerful. Um...
Mono white decks, am I right, ladies and gentlemen? I'm going to play Grasp of Fate. This card's really powerful. Um, it's one of the best cards in Commander in white. When Grasp of Fate enters the battlefield for each opponent, except the one non-land permanent that player controls until this leaves the battlefield. Targets. Elicor. Magnus. Like, Grim Hiling's powerful, but I might target Viscerous Seal. Yeah, I was going to sacrifice. Yeah. Um, so, well, it, it's on the cost. Um, I mean, yeah. I may, can play something like Swanson or... Who knows? All right, so it resolves. Yeah, um, nice. Perfect. Sweet. All right, so it's targets are one, two, three. Do then we have a response to that? No, I don't. No. Cool. Because he can sacrifice himself, can't he? Oh, you're right. Uh, yeah, well, so I can do that. You can sacrifice creature? Yeah, I will. Yeah. sacrifice himself. That's what I was asking, yeah. Oh, thank you. Scry one. Uh, you're going to do that? No command zones? Oh, yeah, actually, yeah, I'm going to put it in the command zone. It's up to you. If you remove mm -hmm. this, like, it'll come back. Would you care for an alliance, good friend? Oh. Look, I mean, look, if he's going to remove the grasp of fate, right, he's going to do it for himself. No one else. Don't listen to him. Right? I mean, are, are, you, are you implying that you may have a sneaky piece of removal for the grasp of fate? Yes. All right, then I'll leave it there. Yeah. I'm going to swing three at Dylan. So now they're making deals. Now I can do it without any, like, repercussions. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So, like, <laughs> we're monocolors. We're pretty cool. We are cool. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. and I, and I drew you. And like, you did. Yeah. Yep. You, you killed my thing. Then uh, you immediately drew me a card. And, like, I'm like a Sims. I'm going to yeah. do one emotion per time. Yeah, yeah. So I was, like, <laughs> angry. I was, like, Oh, no, draw a card. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Um, and you, right. there might be some more draws in the future. And then you yeah, get right. a cat token as well. And I do, and it's attacking you as well. Yeah. So, uh, can uh, we have the tokens? Uh, uh, you know what? Cat I'll make the ta I'll make the token attacking Piper. So, three damage at Dylan, one damage at Piper. Well, Jamin is a blocker, sorry. This is literally the only reason. So, Piper's on 30... 36? Six. Six, that's it. Yeah. And I'm on 35. Yep, that's what I've got. Perfect. And Jamin on 42. Yep, perfect, perfect. All right. Um, I will take a token at... Whenever it's possible. Thank you so much. Do you have a pen? Uh, we'll about to get one. Yes. Our lovely producer Connor is always on top of this. Are you kidding me? What a guy. Drill a cat. Uh, yep, yeah. so and then I'll go to Two. What are you so grumpy for? Because he's a soldier. Yeah. He's he, on the battlefield. He's be happy. He's a cat. Cats love violence. That's true, actually. Oh, I didn't know. That's he fine. Got, he's he's now, he looks one. more like a bear anyway. Yeah, he's more, he's more like a koala now. Yeah, he's, he's, a, you know what, he's a koala. He don't, they don't know yet. Yeah. I'm going to play Phyrexian Metamorph. Okay. Uh, it's going to enter as a copy of Lorraine. And then it's going to blow up Grass of Fate. You know what? He is a koala now. <laughs> he's a one one. Um, no, 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 no. That's on the cast, right? Yeah. I'm going to Soul Potation my own Lorraine. So it gets exiled and we cast it later. And now what does it want to enter as? <laughs> a Cage Sun? Because you have a bunch of swamps. No thank you, Dylan. Nice try. That's actually not a bad idea. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. Big Cage Sun. But uh, it's not going to blow up my Grass Pig, which is better. Dylan's not as Cage Sun enters the battlefield, you what I get for choose trusting a color. <laughs> You could choose like blue or red. I think right like now, a boomer right? tier, like he was it, like black just because he believed, color but she believed right? he lied, kind of thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> there you go. That's the thing. So soul potation is really cool. Um, a spell cast, but opponent costs two more. Like they can recast it. I can now recast it, which means I get to blow up another artifact. Um, I will actually. Um, I will choose blue. Okay. And then I will pass my turn. Oh, watch out. Okay. Some kind of interaction that costs something like four mana. Crazy. Mm. Right, I'm going to play down Training Center. I do, in fact, have two or more opponents. Because oh, everyone at this table is my enemy. Yeah, I was going to say, are we really enemies? Yes. Like, that's kind of crazy. Dude. Yes. Uh, you really are the Imagine Dragons, Piper. <laughs> is that the right band reference? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. yeah. Connor, can please confirm that. <laughs> no, it is. Please bring up the Germa song of him singing <laughs> every single <laughs> person. Please, please don't. Thing. Please don't. That'll be yeah, don't, don't copyright don't, strike. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Right. Don't uh, do even if you it's Germa singing it? Bring up another chat. The German singing the song from Imagine Dragons. Yeah, if I'm gonna play that Soul Ring. If you're watching, go bring that up. Yeah, German watching was it the but Game like, Awards? Yeah, yeah he's but like yeah. separate tab, but pl they're both playing this video and the song in the background. Yeah, 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 that's right. Yeah, yeah. get on that. Thank you guys. Awesome. I'm really yeah. This that that'd be wonderful for everyone. Um. Oh, this isn't a creature anymore, is it? No. No. Dylan made a boo boo. I made a boo boo. 
trouble. Oh no. But you know what, Dylan? You know what's funny? I don't think you want Piper to have back Magnus this turn. Oh no, I'd go on a whim and say that would be a very bad time for everyone. I think it could have been pretty good, okay? You, you I think it could have been fine. You know what? We're just going to prepare for when he is back. <laughs> Misplay again. I'm going to pay I'm going to pay 2 for Flood of Recollection really to get Goblin War Party back. Ooh, goblins. And then that exiles that. And then I'm going to get some goblins. Oh, uh, don't forget you do have this to activate if you'd like to. Yeah, I know. It's like, you know. I'm doing. Of course. Get in twine. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I need the map. Him. Yeah, you one off in twenty. You don't have to. You don't have to cast it this turn. You can. I don't know what else is in your hand, but it, it adds gonna, it back to your graveyard to hand, not yeah. cast it from graveyard. So it's gonna be back in my hand, and then we're just gonna we're just gonna be a bit goofy. We're gonna spell seeker. See, that's very good. Hmm. And then you can still upgrade to his class. Oh, yeah. Crazy, bro. Um. And remember that that X is like zero in the context of spell seeker. Yeah. So, Three and X? Yeah, that can be searched with Spellseeker. That's mm -hmm, powerful. Mm -hmm. Oh, where's my Archivist of Ogma when I need it? Gosh. You and your goddamn white hate what? sick of it. Yep, okay. Oh, hey, I just draw a card, bro. It's not anything like against you, bro. I'm going to stop you. It's like Aven Mind Sensor. That, that would be me. I don't, I don't <laughs> think I'll play that in this deck, though. That'd be hilarious, actually. This deck's a little bit on the... It's not weak by any metric, but it's a little bit on the... These things go really well for me, end. So, cards like Avid Mind Sensor make people get angry and attack me. And I go, oh no. <laughs> no. Oh no. I'm just playing mono white. No, you can't hurt me. I'm a little wanted mono white man. I'm just a little 1 1 cat creature. Yeah. No. Koala cat creature. Oh. You're going to get kicked into the wrong army. He's like, no, no, I'm, yeah. a, I'm a koala type. But we don't have that, sir. We don't have a koala um, type. You have to be a uh, cat. Cat soldier. Cat soldier. Um, you can be a shapeshift if you want, but like, no, I'll find robot. a cat. Yeah, robot. Yeah. Transformer. Necron. Gamer? Uh, noble? Yeah. Give, give him a little monster energy drink. A little <laughs> gamer. It's, quite, it's kind of fun I bring to the table, Dylan. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get pulled from tomorrow, I think. So that I can... Put hey, some cards. Why are you drawing cards? Yeah. 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 <laughs> He's squeezing that monster energy drink. I don't... Man. I'm scared of him. Yeah, yeah he's like, angry. Yeah, he's, he's just mad. looking for some drywall. My little, re my little reptoid brain is like, that one wants to do something. I don't, I don't trust it. <laughs> oh, but Marge, you yeah. haven't done anything yeah. yet. You just I, know, though, you look away. You could do anything. Hit me for 1-1, one, one, win the game. You could do anything. So you're adding that to your hand. I search for pull from, to pull from tomorrow. And then, like the old family guy. Yeah. Wait. I can do this only as a sorcery. Correct. Was it yeah. Simpsons? Yeah, it was Simpsons. No, no, it was, uh, it was a, it's two ones. It's when I'm... Um, uh, the mystery box. If anything, could be a boat. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it's also, box. but it's also, Mr. Burns is the same thing. Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. And then I'm gonna upgrade that. Oh, your turn's still going. And then I'm gonna pass. <laughs> just no, blue a lot red of, things. A lot of that was just me searching through my okay. deck. But no, oh, Jamie, that's okay. Though. Cool. Oh, I'm not gonna do my turn. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm sick of having your turn. Cool. Oh, I got your my turn. So I'm gonna tap the swamp for two black mana. I like when Magic the Gathering Arena, the okay. online platform, does it. I did my form. order wrong. I'm gonna play a swamp for turn. Then I'm gonna do my little tap. Oh, very good. Uh, 12 black mana. Huh. I'm going to spend. Wait, wait, hold yep. on. What's happening? You pay. You tap this as well, right? Yeah, yeah. 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 So tap oh. two? Yeah, but that needs a tap. Yeah, yeah, that taps as well. Yeah. And I have six swamps. I'm just worried that Cabal Couple would just randomly tap twice, and I'm like, oh no. No, no. Uh, so I get 12 black mana. Oh, uh, hang on. Yep. It's wrong. only plus one, not double, right? Add one additional mana. Oh, you're right. So yes. it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. Yeah. Seven. Which seven is mana. still. Yeah. You're all good. Still insane. egregious. Seven mana. So I'm going to use three of that to cast Attrition. Responses? What does yes. Attrition do? I'm going to draw a card with Endless Atlas. Cool. That's it. That's uh, so one doing. black mana can sacrifice a creature, destroy target non black creature. Mm. Mainly for the sacrifice trigger, but it gets kills up as well. It's, it's pretty good. Nice. We said some card draw. Uh, You'll get that. So I have four mana left. Floating, correct. Floating, yep. I'm going to tap... Are you going to kill my guy again if I cast him? No. Okay, cool. I'm going to tap that for a six. These guys are friends. I don't like it. To cast forward. Never win a Sheldon. I have Cage Sun now. I can just keep casting him as much as I want. Pretty I, well, it, yeah. Up to an X point, where I, it's probably I get bored of casting him. Probably, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. How many blockers do you have, uh, Dylan? Zero. Zero. Okay. Could I... 
hit you for four, would you be upset about that? I, I would be a little bit annoyed. Okay. But, you, but you, you'd be miffed, but you wouldn't be like angry. I'd be miffed. Okay, oh, I would, okay we wouldn't reach that level Okay, yet. I'm okay with a little bit of miffing. I think Trent's miffed is a bit as well. When you attrition his cards in response to their triggers, then he'll be miffed, I think. Well, that'll be angry. Fine. You have, some, so that, you have some black cards in there, so maybe you'll avoid it. Yeah. yeah. That'll be pure unadulterated rage. Yeah. Not miffed. Well, anyway, so is he taking so four, you taking, am I taking four? Yeah, so I'm going to swing at you. And a 31. And then I make uh, two treasure tokens. Watch just out. One, right? Why is it two? Uh, deals, you create two. Just, just oh, wow. Two. Yeah. That's crazy. Capital uh, oh, what a dice. What's per player? That's crazy. Jesus. Jesus, that's crazy. What? Oh my gosh, that card is insane. It's a good card. Yeah, I need that in my life, bro. Uh, uh, battle for Baldur's Gate. Many such cases. And now I wish I just had more... Uh, Cards to play, actually. Hmm. Well, if Dylan hadn't tried to remove Lauren, I'd be able to tap into his cards. You know so I appreciate that. You know, I'm so glad that you attacked him because it's really like. Yeah, I'm you know, just going to. I think I'm just going to pass. Beautiful. At the moment, I'm going to untap. Unless there's any Bro, that was self defense, oh. man. <laughs> Control. Well, me exiling my Lauren. No, him trying to. Him trying to. <laughs> you just say that because you would have gone back to Magnus. Yeah. Look, all I'm yeah, saying look. is it's pretty justified what he was doing. Um. Uh, while Trent plays his cards, uh, chat, uh, make a, take a guess now how many misplays you want to do this game. I'm going <laughs> to bet 12. I'm already at one. Okay, yeah, I'm at <laughs> one too. I think, I think I'm just at one. I think I just, it was a misplay of Cabal Coppers. Can you please read out Sorcery Classes level 3 for us? Mm -hmm. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, that spell deals damage to each opponent equal to the number of instant or sorcery cards, yeah, spells you've cast this turn. Storm us to death. Um, okay. Um, well, it depends on how many spells I cast. That is true. If I get Magnus well, back, it could be a death, lot. Yeah. It could be a lot. If Magnus comes back, it could be a heck of a lot. Um, Help me. What we are going to do, hope. right, is we are going to... Got a hope gone. Yeah, I'm honestly screwed. So we're going to go three, and we're going to attempt to cast Lauren. Is there a response, Dylan? No. Are you going to target your own grasp of fate? Oh, no. Uh, let's get into the battlefield. <laughs> that seems like the worst one, because Jamie has no cards in hand, right? So that seems like the worst one, because you have lots of cards in hand, and you can add back Garuda and cast him in the same turn. <laughs> yeah. I can, well, like, we know the loop's going to happen, bro. We've seen it. Come on. We know it's going to happen. Come You're on. You were talking to me about it yesterday. Yeah. You've been excited about it. I know, it. I know. Here I am sitting here not actually playing the game. Yeah. Oh, all right, all right, Dylan. Here. I'm just Dylan. sitting here. Um, that's the ED8 experience. That is the ED8, that's true. You know what, that's true, ED8. Look, I'm kind of in a similar boat. Uh, pipe up. I'm going to go to combat, I'm going to declare attack at you with Bramaz, and Dylan, you're going to take the two one ones. I'll, I'll take the Bramaz damage. So it's just three. Yeah, I'll take three. So Dylan's down to 29. Piper's on 33, Jamin on 42, you on 40. Yeah, James on 42. Uh, oh, could you, um, yeah, you, yeah. <laughs> you, you, you zinged me. You got yeah, me. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. I zinged zinger. You better stop bamboozling people. Yeah, I'm still uh, a good little guy. <laughs> next, we're gonna still cast. Still a little goober. Yeah. Sentinel. Speaking of which, and then lastly, oh, we're gonna cast. I know that card. Because I hate it. <laughs> and that is okay. <laughs> uh, go ahead, Dylan. I don't believe in taxes. Well, just don't pay it then. You don't have to. Yeah, yeah, people get mad at me. No, no, no one's gonna. Just like real life, I don't pay my taxes. People get mad at me. People come to my house. <laughs> Sorry, Dylan. My apologies. I am encroaching on your. This is my space. house right now. My apologies. Let me, let me pull back a little bit. Hey, let me pull back. There we go. There we go, bud. My apologies. Okay. I'm so totally... still going to jump the table at you. Oh well, look. I don't feel like it was wrong to say what. That's eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's Garuda to hand and cast. So I'm not interested. It's a bit powerful. Even without a land, it's Garuda to hand. Nice cast. whisper. I draw two cards. Lose your life. Dylan down to twenty-seven. It's okay, my sorcery class is next, I'm pretty sure. And also, to be fair, it's not like I can really attack uh, Jamin. He will actually just sacrifice creatures in response and kill my stuff, so. Yeah. And make treasures, so it's not good. Yeah, and you guys are a bit buddy buddy One, over that two, side of the board. Well, three. Okay, I feel like I'm a little bit. I'm gonna put Gunria into point. my hand. I don't know if that's like. Your friends at gunpoint. <gasps> then I'm gonna end my turn and put Gunria into my graveyard. <gasps> oh my gosh. Past turn. Oh, okay. sorry, my apologies. Did you pay one S percent Uh, no. Oh, you know what? Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, we'll leave that there then. Well, I apologize for that. Yeah, I know, right? Let's me draw it then. Says. Yeah. Oh, now that I know that you've got a card in hand. Yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. Wait a minute. Fine. That's the resolution of that. What the heck? Oh, ten. Mm 
My pencil oh. is so much better, and I'm not gonna lie, I it's just, very scary. If I had Magnus? put him in my command zone, you'd be okay. We would be we would be vibing right now, but we didn't. Where'd he go? Well, eventually you'll get it back. All oh, right, yes. <laughs> <laughs> because I Forgot trusted, I trusted him. I trusted him. I trusted him. But now you know what I can do. Then again, it was a zesty play what Dylan had. If I didn't have the soul partition, it would have worked really well. So. And he would have had like draw power as well on a stick. It's not a joke. Now that I have enough good. mana to entwine Goblin War Party, I don't even know if I want to do that because like the one person I can really attack is Dylan. Yeah, it's not, it doesn't seem super valid. Yeah. I'm just sitting here helping everyone else. Yeah, I'm not going to attack you. All right, slow down, mate. <laughs> and I'm, like I said, like I said, you know, it would have been helpful to Pipe and have Magus back. It would have helped you to have Melacore back. It's one of these things where it's like you help yourself and it happens to help others. Four. For Goblin War Party. I'm not going to entwine it. I'm just going to create three 1-1 one, one red gobos. Okay. No. Okay. Thank take, you. take your thing. Thank you. I really appreciate that. You know what? Yeah, you would. That does mean a lot to me. You would. Yeah. You would. Okay. Uh, could I please get three Goblin creature tokens? I need Mr. I need producer Connor, thank you so much. Producer. Yeah. Hand over the fat stack. We should have some goblins in there, actually. So Dylan might be able to find one or two. All right. They don't have haste though, good. right? No. Okay. What the hell is this? What is it? It was a 2-2 Vigilance me? <laughs> I don't know what that is. I've never seen that. I've never seen I that one before. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> That's wild, okay. Do like a dissolving flashback shot to that yeah. card being explained. What was that sound? Was it in like play school or like... Oh yeah. It was like... Yeah, yeah. yeah. It was like that weird... Like a hypnotized thing, like yeah. let's go to the orange door. <laughs> and it's like no, through the arch window. window. I'm sick of the arch window. You're always to the arch window. Yeah, you're bringing the triangle once, like once every fortnight, once every month, and you never use it. It's true, actually. You know yeah. what they kind of? I like the arch window a lot, so but one, 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 they do always. It's yeah. one once. Like we get it, you're quirky. It's right? a servo token. Yeah, yeah, come on, bro. Like grow up first of all. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Go on, play school watches. <laughs> Children. Um, it wasn't <laughs> in the children. stack, so really, bam, another gobo. Okay, what? How is that? Anyway, I don't know, man. Uh, I'm gonna. There's a lot of assassins, though. I'm gonna pass the turn and there because I, uh, the is it player wants to leave mana up. That's crazy. Oh, oh, Who thought? If you count any piper, I will go. <laughs> are we sure not to do it then? Yeah. Yeah. Are we sure not to do it then? Because I don't want to deal with that. Cool. I'm gonna play a swamp for turn. Ooh. And I'm gonna. That's gonna tap for. Two to tap Cabal Covers to make one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight black <laughs> mana. Can, yeah. I, can I borrow a little dice? Not Guy Rudolph. <laughs> a little dice? That'll be I've tried two dice. Yeah. Sometimes I put this one oh, over so here's yeah. a bit later. Yeah. You know what, Jamin? Have four more just for later. Oh, thank you. You don't get any of mine, though. These are mine. Yeah, I, that's why I didn't ask for. And you probably say that. Yeah. That's a good point, actually. I kind of really like that. I'm going to use two of those mana <laughs> wow. to cast. Just because I care for my own things. I can't pronounce the name of it, but it's a little bandit. When they attack, I may pay one life. If I do, I get a little treasure token. Zentarim? From Zentarim. Zen They're from the Baldur's Gate set. Zentarim. Damn, you got a real Baldur's Gate aesthetic going on. Yeah. It's, yeah, who would have thought a lot of the, lot of the Baldur's Gate cards have, like, like money? Yeah. Wait a minute. The D&D wow, &D really character cool. likes all the Baldur's Gate cards? Yeah. He Guys, loves them. Can I say, I like your deck a lot. Yeah, thank you. It's really cool. It goes super hard. I wish I had more cards. <laughs> wish you could draw cards, yeah. Yeah, I wish I could actually use my mana or something. Oh. <laughs> Where's your Black Sun Zenith, dude? I mean, that would really make it, it'd be funny. Is that the one where it's... The Put the Mice on Mice on Cows Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a good card. Do you have one? I do, but not on this deck. Okay. It's not super helpful. It's a cool board wipe. Cool. I'm just... Hmm. How much do you want the Esper Sentinel, Trent? Like, do you really want it? If you really want it, I won't destroy it. Uh, no, I, please I do, do destroy want it. it. Hmm? I do really want it, yeah. Okay, that's fine. It, yeah. it cool, powers cool. up his deck. I know. <laughs> okay. well, he, has a, he has a cast non creature spell. You guys should probably stop casting non creature spells, yeah, honestly. Yeah. That's not his fault. Don't blame him for this. Is it just the first one? It's only the first one. Okay. You have three of those or just one? Oh, I have three of those. Yeah, we'll be just making sure. All the goblins. All the goblins. I'm white. They all tap for mana for instant sorceries. Ooh. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe I should kill them all. Oh, maybe. Yeah. I don't know about that. <laughs> no, no, I'm good. I think you won't have any draw power, any creatures, and you'll just lose. Yeah. But I think it's pretty awesome. Uh, I have so much mana and nothing to do with it. I. You, can, you always have the option to attack Dylan. With a I big do. creature. So he's currently, uh, he's a six. Oh, he's a, he's a seven four. Because he gets, oh. Oh, sorry, seven five. Yes, he gets plus one from Cade's son. Um, oh no. So Trent has a three four. I was going to say, I don't actually have a lot of creatures to block that because I'd have to sacrifice quite a few stuff to. Yeah, to that. So I. That's also an option. 
I might have swung at you then, Trent. That's legal. I think. That's so it would be a seven four with menace. Sorry, seven five with menace. Okay. Um, I'm not currently doing much with Bolden, so I think because he doesn't have trample, I will attempt to declare two blockers, two blood ones into him. Cool. Good. Cool. They both die. So no common damage is dealt, so I don't make any treasure tokens. That's the only thing I wanted. Oh, it doesn't matter anyway. I have another thing. Um, and then, yeah, I think that will be my turn, unfortunately, because again, see more cards. That's the one thing that I've noticed whenever I play Mono Black as well. You either have like, you're, like really short on lands and have like a lot of cards to play, or you yeah. have like way too much mana. I have decent card play. draw on the deck. I just haven't, unfortunately, drawn one of those card draw cards, so yeah. Wait. What? I know, right. We're going to play three. I'm going to play a card I really like. It's a little bit overrated, but I like it. It's called Smuggler's Share. At the beginning of each end step, draw a card for each opponent who drew two or more cards this turn. Then create a treasure token for each opponent who had two or more lands in the battlefield under their control this turn. That second half is probably not going to come up um, unless somebody does like legitimately evolving wilds crack. Um, but you know, I might be able to draw cards. Then I'm going to. I think it's time for E Honda to make his appearance at long last. I'm sorry. So who? Bolden, the Century Herdmaster. Yeah, that's what, thank you. Um, it's fine. It's like. Um, and then I will. I'll pass turn, Dylan. I'll play a luxury suite that enters untapped because I have two or more opponents. Ooh. Spicy. It's very spicy. One, two. Dance of the Dead, holding priority. Two blue, two black. C double copying Dance of the Dead. What does Dance of the Dead do for us, Dylan? Dance of the Dead is take target creature from any graveyard and put it directly into play under your control tapped with a, with plus one plus one. Treat the creature as though it were just summoned. The creature does not untap during its controller's untap step. At the end of his or her upkeep, its controller may pay an additional one and a black to untap it. If Dance of the Dead is removed, bury the creature in its own graveyard. Trigger. It's old text. Um, I will pay the one. Sure. Um, so C double is copying Dance of the Dead, so it'll make a copy of Dance of the Dead as a permanent. So that'll come in, and I will get back Phyrexian Metamorph as a copy of Loran. Okay. And then I will blow up Grasp of Fate. Uh, when this does this, can you blow up Loran, please? Do I kill it somehow? Yeah, I can do that. Yeah, you can do uh, that. If you. No, if you. It's the only answer. Yeah, cool, good. I'm going to pay. One black to sacrifice a creature. I'm going to sacrifice the bandit. Uh, and I will then destroy. In response? Yep. We'll both draw a card. Sweet. <laughs> okay, so then Phyrexian Metamorph is going to enter as something else. Also make so a treasure token as, as something. We'll sacrifice this token. Um, it's going to enter as a copy of. <gasps> oh my gosh. You're having a cage on back. No, because then this will fall right off it. True. Um, I'm going to get a copy of Brimaz. Hmm. Very cool. Oh, white creature. It's Brimaz! Yeah. That I know it is. This is not a way to treat a Primarch. Um, you know that. And then Dance of the Dead's really no, bad. Honestly, pretty Go old brain for Chaos Primarch. <laughs> he rocked up, said, did nothing, and then got. Put away somewhere. The sequencing of that was still the correct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, of course. It's annoying, but it was still correct. Um, Garuda enters. It's kind of correct, right? Garuda trigger. Mm. So we well, all Yeah, the sequencing four? would have had Bellacor back for Garuda to enter. Yeah, or you could have had two Garudas, which is also yeah. equally as good. So we mill the top four? Yep, mill yep. top four. One, two, three, four. My only target was Captain of the Watch, but I will build three lanes otherwise. Uh, You've got Murmuring Mystic or Talrand. So even, 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 even creature, even uh, none of those. Um, I will play Phantasmal Image. Image. You did mill, you did mill my Comet Storm though, you bitch. That's pretty yeah. rude. Phantasmal what Image will enter as a copy of Gyruda, and I will sack Phantasmal Image for Legendary Rule. Your Forge will trigger. Uh, once yeah. per turn. Yeah, turn once per turn. That's still on the same turn. Yep. Yeah. Is it still the same turn? Isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I did that. Um, yeah, yeah. So this is coming off the Gyruda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
And then so I have another Guy Rudo trigger. Now there's a Guy Rudo trigger on the stack. Sorry. There is an option for you to kill Guy Rudo, so if he hits a clone, you can't clone Guy Rudo and keep going. Okay. Uh, oh, no, it's black. You can't no, no, I, I have something. I, yeah. uh, what's, what's his current toughness? Six. Seven. Oh, seven? Yeah, because of the. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You picked up one of your lands just Yeah, then. I did. My apologies. I'm going to defile. Oh. So you minus seven, minus seven, you'll go rid of. Uh, trigger. You pay uh, one? I, oh, yeah, because I tapped for two. Yeah, I'll lose that one. Yeah. Card. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. No, no. Don't feed him. <laughs> he has yeah. the thing on the board that benefits from having creatures. I can blow but it up. Yeah, but he can just blow it up if I do anything. It's, like, it's, like, it's, like, it like, uh, transports the most targetable out of all of them. Yeah, I like it. it right, doesn't matter. Four. It doesn't matter. Two, three, no evil. No like creatures. Good cards. No creatures. Clever impersonator. Clever impersonator will enter as a copy of Grasp of Fate. Ah, oh, no. All right. I will choose Grasp of Fate, Cage Sun. It's a very good pull. It's for each opponent. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and Dual Sorcerer Plus. In response. Sorry. Yeah. No, I'm not. I'm it's not the target on the graph to It's not going to counter anything. I'm not going to counter it. I'm just okay. still yeah, tapping these for mana while oh, I can. Okay. And they still have yeah. the targets. So they have a response window. Yeah. So one, two, three, four. I draw eight cards with pull for tomorrow. That's powerful. Yeah, I don't see why not. I'm going to cast pull for tomorrow with X is eight. What about them? Oh, that's it, yeah. These are all caps. Yeah, yeah, that is the eight. Yeah. So I'm going to draw eight cards and then discard a card. Cool. And then everything resolves. Dylan, I hope this was worth it. Oh, I hope this was worth it. Oh, Piper spells cost three less to cast. <laughs> Minimum. Boom. Bellacor enters. I draw one card. Uh, I lose one life. Lodges himself, yeah. So I'm down to 26. So I'm going to steal this Dance of the Dead and put it onto here so that we know what this is. So that is also a Brumaz. Yeah. Um, and then I will. Pass my turn. At the end of the turn, I'll draw two cards because two opponents draw two or more cards this turn. That's true, actually, yeah. Because you drew with Bellacor and for turn. Oh, yep. Yeah. Yep, yep, and yep, you yep. only drew a card, correct? Yes. Yes. But so I drew I'll, eight. You drew eight cards. Yes. I was so very, I'll draw, I was I'll draw very happy two cards, which is quite nice. So I'm up to six cards in hand in my mono white deck. Can't argue with that, folks. Can't argue with that. I have two creatures. Okay, and okay. This has both a Grasp of Fate and is a Grasp of Fate. I'm going to put a mountain down as my land for turn. What are you what are you whinging about over there? What are you whinging about? If you just win, I'm not even gonna be surprised. If you just <laughs> win the game, I'm not even gonna be surprised at all. Alright? What the little noise that you do. Oh well, you can just blow you it can up. blow it up Magnus. Whatever yeah. you want. Oh, you could yeah. have done it in the untap step, I know. upkeep step. Well he's got he's, he knows. Look at him. He knows. That's true. He I, like, I like the little grim highly. That's true. You are you are gonna lose things actually. Yeah, that's a good yeah. point. I, I, you only have so many of those. Yeah. Well the option is losing one creature or losing the game, so that's up to you. Okay. <laughs> that's a good point. <laughs> <laughs> it will depend, honestly. Yeah. Harder could not yeah. win the game. I Watch could this. not win yeah. the game, and that's very true. I'm gonna play Mystic Retrieval. Which is going to get me target instant or sorcery <gasps> card back from my graveyard. Name your target. Name your target. Wait for this. It's gonna be called the War Party. Watch this. How'd you know? <laughs> it's an awesome card. It's, it's a very cool card. I want to do it now. Yeah. There's still some. There's still some funny things that I haven't even cast because of all the milling that. Uh, that you get a bunch of cards back, and this is flashback. It's not like yeah. you can't get more cards. It's really good. You yeah. can get God of War Party and then play it, and then get God of War Party and then play it. <laughs> you know what I mean? So many goblins. So many goblins. Very Tomar of you. <laughs> Wait, I could. So many goblins. How many? We have like a few artifacts on board, though. I could release the gremlins. You could release the gremlins, yeah. I yes. could release the gremlins. Oh, uh, did you pay the one for Esper? I assume you did, right? Yes. Sure. I did. You know, maybe it is just Goblin War Party, okay? No, no, release goblins is actually not a joke. Yeah. Dylan has one, two, three. I have one, two, three, four, five. And then Jamin has one, two, three. It's not a joke, actually. Yeah. 
Then again, he can crack the treasures in response, but it doesn't, That's true. doesn't stop them from being very good. Mm. Yeah. Look, Dylan. Did you, generate, did you generate any of these? I got you back your Magnus. Oh, yeah, I generated one. It's only, it's only okay, one. you yeah, got me back my Magnus. Target, That's right? true. Oh, yes, you're right. You got me back my Magnus. So one of them will not be able to be tapped. Like, yeah, but come on. You know, if it gets you more gremlins, it gets you more gremlins. You know what I'm saying? And That's he did. True. By the way, can we make this clear for both of you? All right. He did not get you back his your Magnus. He got himself back his Bellacore. I made a promise. I made a promise. <laughs> he says. <laughs> and I kept to that. Promise. All right, all right, all right, all right, you're right. We'll see how things go moving forward. You know what? We're going to release the gremlin. We're going to get released the gremlin. Cool. What did that do? Uh, destroy, it's, it's XX and a red. Destroy X target artifacts, create X22 two, two red gremlin creep tokens. And how many X, what's the X? I haven't cast he hasn't, it yet. She's not cast it yet. Okay, cool. Yeah. So okay, you, cool. you can kill Magnus in response to the target. Yes, so that they never have a chance. But if they don't target your treasures, would you kill Magnus? Uh, yeah. Yeah, all right, whatever. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna <laughs> that Grim Hiling. You have no cards left, man. <laughs> I know. Yeah, I uh, know. Blob Magnus. Do you make another tap treasure token? Do you reckon that was quiet enough that the mic didn't pick it up? Hopefully. Piper said they're going to jump the table and assault it. <laughs> and they said if I said it out loud, they will definitely do it. And if I go missing with like X Magnus amount again. of time. I do have enough mana to play Magnus again, but I don't think you understand. You also have enough mana just to play release the gremlins like so manually. X equals three. <laughs> X yeah. equals three. Which still, you know, slows down. It still kills all three of these cards. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> And not the S Sentinel at all. Well, I, they I, can just pay the one, and they already have, bro. Like, come on. I already have, yeah, I'm not going to lie. You're the looping all these big demons guy. He's going to draw off S for Sentinel. I, it's not if you pay them not one, pay the one. Like, which you I've been doing. The one. I've been I, I paid the I one paid, every I time. I paid the one every yeah, time as yeah. well. He has paid the one. Wait a minute. So how am I drawing cards off it? It's almost like I haven't been. You know what? It's you guys drawing cards that I've yeah, been like drawing. Yeah, like one time. You know what? Yeah, one time. Yeah. It's a little, a little gift. Look, here's my thing. Here's my thing. Okay. Dylan is relying very heavily on mana. He's a big mana heavy deck. That's all. You know what I mean? And Jamin can control my board. I can't really go into him. He has, no, he has to sacrifice thing. I can now start going into Jamin as well. So, you know. And Trent requires cards in hand. Young That's always answer. true. But I have cards in hand. <laughs> you know what I mean? I should have done that before I, I did Jamie, the other you thing, want but more. Here we are. I do. I always want more. Very cool. Young Pyromancer. I like him. Yeah. Now your gremlins is X's two, correct? If you want yeah. to cast it, yeah, if that's I want to cast it. Trent, when it comes to card draw, you are Kylo Ren in The Last Jedi, the cinematic masterpiece, The Last, the Last Jedi. Jedi. <laughs> that's what we say about that. <laughs> more, more, more. I love my card draw, guys. What can I say? What can I say? I still am going to release the gremlins. I think. I think. I think it's a good idea. Yeah. It's up to you what you want to do, of course. Unless you have some other cards in hand, or you want to flashback another card with your... No, I'd keep the Mystery Trooper for later, actually. Yeah. I'm going to release the Gremlins, where X is 2. Because, yeah, you don't have... The Breamaz is, like... That's powerful, but it's fine. Yeah. Is that tapped? No. Two. It doesn't enter tapped. It does. Four. Oh. Okay. Seven. So there's a one blocker. Yeah, so X is 2. So I get to... Uh... So the best targets on my board are, without a doubt... Um, Thought Vessel, Soaring, Endless Atlas, and Esper Sentinel. And the only yeah. two cards on Dylan's board that matter are the two rocks as well. Yeah, and the one tapped treasure, I guess. The two Jamin's tapped treasures. Oh, two tapped treasures. I'll block both of James' treasures, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, he did block my Magnus, but... That's true, but you could just block him. He's just menace, nothing special. Yeah. Uh, so I'm going to... You could kill the card draw. You could kill both the card draw, yeah. I have lots of card draw. Look, but you could uh, Rear Endless Atlas asked me again. I forget. Uh, just pay two tap draw a card because I have three lands with the same name. That's yeah. all it is. It's pay two tap draw a card. It's fine. Look, I'm gonna t I'm gonna get rid of the. <sighs> I'm gonna probably get rid of the Esper Sentinel. That's fine. And then. In your mind, I got you back, Magnus. You got oh. you back, Bellacore. Yeah, come on. I got you back, Magnus. Get out of here. Yeah, then you convinced Jamin to kill it. So yeah, stop you it. did actually. And I'm I not saying you didn't have that decision yourself. No, no, it was it was actually Tyler Dillon. Like, yeah. <laughs> let, let, let us know. I'm just a little puppet man. <laughs> if you want to support us here at Hardcast, make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and get the bell on to get notified every time a new video goes live. I think I'm. I, all right, so well, that's the when I do that, I make two gremlins and one elemental. Yes, very good. Can I have, uh, please have those two? Oh my god, okay. Uh, when I'm targeting you, and you think I'm a little puppet master controlling forwards, there's a bigger person behind me, and that's everybody who oh can my talk god. to me. Yeah. Everyone who can talk <laughs> to you. Any idea? Just do you have an earpiece? 
We are the red. No, no, just someone approaches me right now and just be like, do X. I'm like, okay. <laughs> we are the red wizards of Thane. Yeah, yeah it's, me uh, and Mag it's me and Magnus. We have a, a really fruitful relationship. Get yeah. out. Okay. Oh, you have a gobbo? <laughs> you found the gobbo? Look, look at all these gobbos. Oh, look at them. But they're not gremlins. No, they're not gremlins. Well, here is a fire elemental. Thank you. Oh, he's adorable. And then I need a gremlin. gremlin. They have like little, yeah, little trunks. Little yeah. Trunks. They're like little Max Revos. <laughs> Draw <laughs> tree trunks from Adventure Time, but d d different enough you don't get sued for it. They like to slurp the ether. Little ether slurpers? Yeah. Love, Love them. They get high as fuck. Bro, who Language. doesn't? I'll bleep it out. <laughs> they get high just, as bleep the wrong, just bleep the wrong word. They get. Brought as yeah, I'm, I'm gonna make them do more work, but yeah. Little <laughs> home, I said it. I said a, a root word. <laughs> I love them. Now you're Chandra Gremlin Wrangler. It's me. Just like you. Excellent. I'm gonna pass. Oh my god, she is literally me. <laughs> hope, I draw, hope I draw some cards to help me this turn. That'd be I, I hope you don't. Yeah, I won't. Let's be honest. I don't. Hmm. 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 Her. Hmm. Her. I'm going to let's just search for any instant the sorcery. Oh, CMC three or less. CMC two or less. Two or less. Five or less. Five or less. Seven. I'm going to throw us three. Five Have that. I can search psychic. Seven search, yeah, black mana. Psychic, but I can't search damnation. No. no. Can search black sun zana. I did not put that in this deck. You can't search. Uh, I'm gonna spend three. She can't play either, but still. To cast <laughs> black market connections. Oh, let's go! Yeah, good card. Good card, good card. More treasures. More treasures. More life. More me killing myself. Yes. In Magic the Gathering, of course. Of course. Of course, of course. Of course. That's been a pretty interactive game. Yeah. Hmm. hmm. We're gonna have some more stuff to do. Six token. Be very afraid. I want to cry. Or I will soon die. To the tokens. And the flashback. I will think that's the path, unfortunately. Um, untap, upkeep. Don't look at my board. No, no, sorry. I just think <laughs> you, didn't, you didn't draw any extra cards last turn, did you? No, no I, I drew say. the one. Just want to make sure. Yeah. Uh, untap, upkeep, draw. Which I paid the S% percent on trigger for. Yes, of course. Because I'm a good magic player. Yes. And yes. I will go to combat. That is objective. Dylan. I'll save these both of you. Bolden is going to give them both plus seven toughness, which makes them a 14 14 and an 11 11. And a little cat as well? And I get a little cat. Um, this triggers as target, so this doesn't get any bonuses. Oh, yeah, of course. So the 14 and the 11 is 25. That is correct. What's your life total like? 26. Yeah, so that's 26. I'm going to block the 1 1 with Bellacore. Okay. And go to 1. Oh my gosh. You just like blood artist. Like, <laughs> 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 All right, well that's fine with me. All right, the, the guy dies and you go down to one life left, um, which is not the absolute best, but it's fine, it's fine. Um, main two, I'm gonna play a land. It's a tapped Windbrisk Kites. I will hide away. And I will... <laughs> okay, okay, well good thing I can play the card. How are we going, Piper? On a, on a, if I had a little, like the Sims, like friendship meter, how, how you look, how you little emoji looking right now? It's still like, it's still leaning towards friendship. You okay, know, I'd say good. we're like, it's it's like, we're not acquaintances, we're friends. We're not good friends or best friends, but we're friends. Okay, it makes you know? me feel any better. I didn't just throw Magnus because I was upset with it. I just throw Magnus because I don't like how the stack works. I don't wanna, I wanna, I have to think about the stack. I'm like, if I just kill the, all the sorcery cards, I don't have to worry about the stack. Everything's so casting at sorcery speed, everything's really slow. You know what? I can appreciate that. Yeah, yeah. yeah the stack is annoying. Yeah. Take it away, Dylan. I'm going to leave um, all this matter. I'm going to play Pokemon, but not Pokemon. I'm going to pay two and untap his blue mask. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, no, I want to play Magic, but everyone has that Teferi. There's a fairy card that you can't play cards. You can't play cards your opponent's turn. That's play a drowned Catacomb. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mage of Zalfir? Yeah, that's what I want. Yeah, it's like you can only cast spells at sorcery speed, right? Yeah. Teferi, Mage of Zalfir. Yeah. yeah. Oh, um, are you thinking of the. Planeswalker? Yeah. That's um, Time Raveler. It's very Time Raveler. Yeah. That's three fairy, in other words. Sorry, it's very Two. Mage Zalfir is the creature that says, yeah, yeah. sorcery speed only. They both say can. Arcane thing. Signet? One's a Planeswalker, one's a creature. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, oh. Mm -hmm. You're feeding oh. a Dockside. Yeah, straight up. He could play the Dockside, by the way. Yeah. So could you. <laughs> yeah. But he can't. 
Um, it's back. It's back. Us first, then yep, again. Yeah, I'm sorry. A classic. Or a stable. Did you give a dock side? You could have dock side. I, I I do run red as a part of my color yeah, identity. No. I, so, therefore, yeah, I could side, I yeah. could run dock side. It's like Schrodinger's deck. You yeah. could have a dock side in there. Nightmare Shepherd. Ah. And I will deal four damage to. If you don't attack me this turn, I will kill Grimaz. Okay. Or I can kill Forge. Which one? Ah. Uh. On the proviso you don't attack me. <laughs> I won't attack you, man. I won't attack you, bro. Let me tell you something. Um. I mean, Forge is not a huge threat to me right now, I don't think. Grimaz. Four damage from Bellacore's Awesome Sword. So uh, Attempt to cast a phrase protection. Until the end of my next turn, my life total can't change, and I gain protection from everything. All permanent I control phase out. Yep. Trent doesn't exist. <laughs> <laughs> um, then can I'm you just... edit him out? Can you? Can you edit? Can you? <laughs> wait. Can you cut this in, Trent? Can you used to say, "Let me be clear." Let me be clear. And then can you? And then we just like. Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Let me be clear. That is gonna be like the yell, but the, ah, and it's the high. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. Pass. Okay. Untap. A little Ford's loophole. He said, "Don't attack you this turn." Applying the turn that Dylan was in. So that yeah, was exactly. Turn, you're going to attack him this turn. He did say he this would turn. not violate any agreements. Yeah, of mm -hmm. course. That's all Ford's tip of the week. Yeah, <laughs> betray people. <laughs> <laughs> betray people. Lose yeah. all your money. It was a grind set. Yeah. Just like. <laughs> That's really yeah. cool. It's a great card right there. I, I, I should have just got a play. drawing a card. That's what I should have done. I'm a fool. Okay. All right, so Magnus cost me seven mana at the moment. I've got seven mana. Let's see, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven mana. Wonderful. I'm going to cast Magnus. Does anyone have a response to me casting Magnus the Red? I am then going to think for a long time because I don't usually play Is It Spell Slinger. Your Is It Spell Slinger is currently cost six less. They do indeed, which is wonderful. I think it's very powerful. It's yes. very very wonderful. All that thing. Let's go to the uh, the mid game, uh, like you know, like in the stands, like yeah, the two yeah. commentators. But it's us. <laughs> How's the game going, Trent? How do you think it's going? Oh, really? Quite good, actually. I have no permanents currently in play, uh, and my life total can't change. <laughs> nice. Oh, you're also, you're not even here. Yeah. Cut, cut him out of this, this second bit as well. It's <laughs> <laughs> just me now. Um, I want more cards. Back to me, Jamin. <laughs> <laughs> You'll draw two cards next turn, though. That's pretty good. Right. I worry that you've been like, kind of left to your devices for. A moment too long. Two moment too long. Yeah. Don't worry, I don't know what my devices are. <laughs> it's in front of me, the gizmo, I'm like. <laughs> I just like a little thing up, like, oh no. Oh no, yeah, back down. Back down. It's like you with the mind flare. Yeah. I'm going to pay one Four. to flashback Mystic Retrieval. <gasps> Targeting. Targeting, pull from tomorrow. Okay. Everyone's cool with that? Yep. You also trigger. I, I do. I'm tapped. Destroying my rip. Then I can cast Pull from Tomorrow with just like these two. To draw then, seven. Yeah, to draw seven, which I will do. Which will get me another one of these bad boys. The permanent doesn't exist. Whatever. It's fine. Um, At least Bremaz does. It's in a very worrying position. Four, five. Seven. Just trying to incentivize people to go elsewhere. <laughs> I know, but it's not going to work, Dylan. You're in such a good position to be incentivizing people going elsewhere, man. I'm not going to lie to you. You're in too good a position. But I'm just a 
I'm just a cheeky little boy on one life. You're a cheeky yeah. lad, man. But you're, only, you're only on one life, which is super important. That's Bellacore's motto. I'm just a cheeky little guy. I'm just, <laughs> just, 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 just a demon hood. I'm going to be a little yeah. demon god. Yeah, don't forget, yeah. Viper. Dylan is on one life. It's my so. demon birthday. I know, just, yeah. Should be swing, yeah. swing. How many creatures have? How many blockers No, I said that I wouldn't attack him this time. This turn? Yes. Well, that's that's a bit awkward. Like, you can sweep it, like like a one damage sweep or something, you know? Yeah, you're right. I feel like each opponent takes one damage. You crack it with power, X is, you know, eight. Doesn't matter. If only. I'll just kill myself with Bellacore yeah, if you, and Nightmare if, Shepherd. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if Bellacore triggered. Is this mandatory? No, I no, may. Thank God. Oh my God. Oh, if that was mandatory, I wouldn't have phased it out either. That'd be really funny. If you like removed it. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna pass the turn there. Cool. With. All this is going on. I've got two blue mana on tap. Do you have a max hand size? I do, so I'm gonna discard down to size now. Um. It's very weird. No one's attacking. Well, it's a weird position. I mean, Piper may not have anything to. You kind of did make a deal with you not to attack you. Like the the in this turn part yeah. is a funny meme, but that's kind of like we knew what the implication of that was. Um, so, and they could just attack you and kill you. So you you know should be very thankful because it wouldn't hurt them to stack with their six uh, six tokens, just, like four tokens, and just kill you. It wouldn't even hurt their board state. It's true. I would just kill. I would kill you. If you didn't do that, I would have done it. Just. Oh, I really should have used my cards to draw and go for land and such, but I'm silly. Oh, that's how you learn, man. I was too excited to depth out. So it's part of editing, just edit back to that point. Yeah, yeah, and then fix it up. Yeah. I want to edit real life back to that point. Yeah. yeah. And let's make six, the same misplay. Seven. <laughs> How many misplays oh, was that? No. If we counted every card, you would have tapped as a misplay. It was How many? One, two, three. Okay, so we're currently at five misplays, I think. <laughs> Most, I think we're five. Yeah, five. five. Yeah, pretty good. I have the majority of those. Yeah. <laughs> uh, as is tradition. This is going to be rough to discard all these, but I think I have to. But what are they? One sec. I'm just going to decide on. Oh, I want this one instead. Oops, oh, my lord. I'm just giving up those one mana account spells. Alright, so I'm going to discard a Mountain, Sahili, Mountain, Deep Analysis, Archmage Emeritus, Wandering Fumeral, and Goblin Electromancer. What did they keep? Yeah, that's. Oh, the Emeritus is gone. But I do love that um, Deep Analysis in there. Yeah. Then that's your turn. Cool. I'm going to untap. I love Deep I'm going Analysis. To draw. Uh, <laughs> then in my pre combat main phase. I'm going to sell contraband, <laughs> buy information, and hire a mercenary. So I'm going to lose six life in total. Full set, full set, full set. <laughs> Jamin down to 36. Uh, and I yeah, Jamin's taken the first amount of damage he's ever taken in the game. And, it's and then I'm going to hire a mercenary, which is a 3 2 colorless shapeshifter. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, he. I'm going to play Trezor. <laughs> Correct. Correct. <laughs> I'm going to play Trezavolt for turn. It is a Koala Let's go. Wow. 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 Isn't that beautiful frame. That is an amazing and frame. And then you mean a swamp. I'm going to... It is also a swamp. a swamp. Yes. And as, as my classic thing... Eight. Uh, eight? No extra mana anymore. Mm, I know. Remember who did this to you. I'm going to use two of that mana. Cast Nether Trader. Ooh. I'm then going to use one of that mana to village rights, uh, sacrificing Nether Trader. That then triggers the effects of Forge, which makes me a tapped treasure token. And then draw two cards. Well, you know, your reference, you could ask the Blue Player to have a response before you tapped it. I'm very sorry. Yeah. That's okay. Any responses? No. Sure, not I assume that I, my sum today is blue players don't do something, they're, they're going to let us know. Yeah. They're, they're going to be f***ing. <laughs> you just wait so, you just wait so <laughs> quickly for the two draw, man. Yeah, yeah. I think you were much faster. That's actually how you end. counted the blue player. You just go so fast yeah. Yeah, that don't they don't... Yeah, you don't get any room to interact. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, it was resolved. Stop. <laughs> I've already drawn. I've already drawn. I've already drawn. What are you going to do? Stop me? Bro, climb the table. Judge. I dare you. I think that's Burnett Lane, bro. I dare you. I'm going to then Stops spend... Us. They didn't They didn't. They didn't hold their priority. It's true. Three mana. To victimize. So you choose two target cards yep. in graveyard. You then sacrifice creature, and if you do, they get return taps. There's no cost of sacrifice, which is good. And then Piper can respond if they need to respond. Yeah, what, what are, are your targets? targets? My targets will be Grim Hiling and. Hmm. Wow, Dylan really sacked you out of those mills. Yeah, yeah. That's not good. 
I'm gonna do Dockside Chef. Are you gonna Are you gonna f me if I let these things evolve? Gonna... Probably not. Yeah. Well, the card is getting it. Like yeah, it's fine. Cool. Yeah, yeah. You know what? We're good. Cool. So I'm gonna. So this is why I'm just sitting with only land in my So hand. I'm choosing yeah, yeah. Grim Highland oh, and Dockside Chef. I'm then going to sacrifice the. Change the shapeshifter. Yep. They turned the battlefield now tapped. Well, before that, I think I don't know the orders of this stuff. Uh, yeah, when you go to the graveyard, I'll then pay one black to return a Never Trader to the board tapped. I think the way this is fine, but I think the way Victimize works is it will fully resolve and then this will come. Okay, cool. Yeah, so that will happen, and then at the end of it, I'll do that. Yeah. This is untapped, mm -hmm. but it can't block anyway. But it's still cool. And it has haste. It is built to haste. Yeah, and then we can. <gasps> Oh my god, Dylan, you can't block it. I can't block it. It's yeah. one damage, Dylan's one life. With haste. <laughs> oh, well, you have this card now. Yeah, okay, never mind. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to use that last black mana. Tap from two for three. Play a Bastion of Remembrance. Nothing dying this turn yet. Nothing died yet, Dylan. Sorry, Dylan. And I'm going to crack one treasure and that to play. Party leader. He's a le he's an orc, but he's also a cleric, rogue, warrior, and wizard. Gets around. When he attacks, defending player loses X life, and I create X treasure tokens, which X is the number of creatures in my party, which is rogue. Yeah, yeah two. two. And yeah, because you have two rogues. Oh no, he's all of them. No, but he only counts for one. It of the only counts for parties. one of the possible party members. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Weird mechanic. Yeah. It, yeah, it's weird. It's like you have to have four creatures to get all four, which didn't come out in the D and D set. Yeah, you know what I mean. Anyway. Sorry. Bonkers. I like they didn't put that into yeah benches above yeah, else. Even though Zendikar Rising was right before it and introduced yep. the mechanic and, and definitely foreshadowed that. In fact, yep. look, uh, we need to stop talking about because like nothing nothing pisses me off more than the fact that they so didn't put it in air. So he doesn't count all that creature type he has, or he does, he, but he just doesn't. He only counts as one of your party. It is all those creature types, but your party is one creature for each. You okay. need different four different creatures. Oh, that's weird. Hmm. Yeah, it's just so you can. He have, fills he fills the empty okay. slot. Really yeah, mechanic. so you, you you could have like that's all, no no yeah. just just the. It is worded strangely, yeah. Going the gate, I'm killing him now, I don't like him now. Yeah, well, you I, know, it, it's, it's two. You're minimum yeah, two. I, I, yeah, I don't want to track that though. You know what? Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Just for that, I'm going to kill Dylan. Now I'm now angered. No, I'm fine. No, I won't do that. <laughs> you might as well. Um, I reckon you can. You can. Yeah, um, you can. It's one of those things where it's like, you now have enough creatures that I can't. You can, but Trent will get back Grasp of Fate. It's true, but, you know, I may not interact. I'll get my Kate Sun back, actually. Yes, I was swinging at you for one. That's true. He gets his case. You did put that out before <laughs> you pointed that yeah. one out. <laughs> All right, sorry. All right, so I do a grasp of payback. Wait, um, it's a delayed trigger. It still happens. Yeah, because because this does this leave I'm the leaving the battlefield. Yeah. All right. My sorcerer class, and it comes back to the battlefield, which means I get to draw two, discard two. That is really good. Um, I'm going to target. Um, I'm going to target attrition, because it's the only thing that really scares me the most. Yep. And I'm going to target Magnus the Red. Cool. Don't. He's going into my command zone yes. this time. Thank you. Just this here until, until this leaves the battlefield. Wait. So before that happens, you can respond. Yes. Yep. Oh, I'm still phased out. Oh, you are. This then my ne only then never mind. Then yep, yeah. you're good. This is my only permanence. Unless you want to blow up some of this. Now I'm good. Okay. I think you bang it pipe for a bit now. I have. Yeah, but it's worth it because they we're gonna win. Definitely with all those card draws. They drew like 17 cards, people. I can't imagine that they weren't just gonna win. I'm gonna discard ignite the future. And oh man, everything else is great though. I actually really feel like they phase in something. before you untap during your untap stacks. I have no room to do anything. Okay. Wait. Okay. You have an upkeep set. Yeah, untap that's upkeep. after untap. Yeah. Yeah, I can't do anything. It's like before untap it comes back, I can do my stuff and then no. they go to untap. It's not like I can do that, so. And um, optimal I'll pass. Alright. I will untap and then everything will everything will phase back in. I will then untap. And then I will draw. <sighs> I was going to uh, flicker for a team metamorph next turn. That would have been very powerful. So it was a good idea then. Cool. Uh, Fable Passage. It's going to come down. Oh no, I don't have any swamps anymore. No. Oh, oh no, you, know you only have one, two, three, four, five. I know. Not as good. Not as good. Shouldn't you do have, have a lot more matter anyway. Yeah, it so shouldn't have killed yeah. me. No, no, it's still the best choice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is one of the few decks I've played on Hardcast, so I actually genuinely want to keep playing. It's great. Yeah, that's fair. Not you to say that I don't like the decks I play, it's just that like... You do love your demons though. I love demons. Mm. Um, 
but like the the whole process of putting the deck together and pulling it apart again for the next episode, like a lot of times, it's just kind of like, well, I don't I don't really get to hold on to that deck. Um, I might as well just crack the fable passage while I'm here. That's right point. I would have made a the, the human soldier as well when I brought. Play it tapped planes, which will then untap. Oh yeah, of course. Just replayed Star Scream. Yeah. <laughs> Star Scream sick. I think your Bellacore deck went super hard. Mm. It was just like we had to keep interacting with you. That's the thing. Like with the early attrition was disgusting though. Let's be honest. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we got yeah. It came out what right after you got rid of the Cage Sun too. It was like yep. right after that it came out. Yeah, dangerous, dangerous. I'm not gonna lie. Okay. You may it, it may have felt a bit like you were just sitting there doing nothing, but if we allowed you to do anything. That's yeah. I know. <laughs> but hey, what I say, the game is now in a good position. So. Yeah. Typical Dylan plays. Yep, yep. I'm gonna do nothing. I'm gonna do everything. All right, so I'm gonna try and go for a draw here with Endless Atlas. That is very useful. Um, we are going to... Someone's getting hit. Yeah, but I've been taken down a peg though because I don't have Magnus anymore. So, you know, I'm safe. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter, you have all the blockers in the world. But That's I like true. them. I want to you don't them. have no trample. I have no trample built in, so. Playing white wings. Um. Money <laughs> spent. Mm. Somehow this card in my hand is not worth 10 mana to resolve the way I want it to. Somehow it's just not worth it. Um, I should probably remember that's there. Um, Before we do anything, look at Dylan's face. No, that's no. fine. And then they looking at Papa's deck. I know, I know. But I just a mono white deck. Like, <laughs> I'm gonna, yeah. I, have, I have one option. That mana tide sitting right there, that's all he's got. Um, Uh, I'm going to he, Sensei spin. He can't spin keep winning the, top. the first yeah. game. I know. He can't keep winning the first game we record. I know, I know. It's too can't much. keep getting away with it. I'll go to there. I will draw a card. Clean the Sensei from the top. Oh, my hand's not right. I'm going to pay for two. I'm going to attempt to cast Grain Abolisher. So during my turn, my opponent's card cast spells are activated abilities of artifacts, charms, or creatures. I'm going to pass to Pipes Priority and get rid of this before they can't. If they want to, obviously. It's up to them. I'm baiting them with the Grain Abolisher and then they can't solve anything else, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, I, uh, I'm just going to let that resolve. Oh, you're going to let that resolve, are you? Yeah. Okay. All right, well, now you can't play anything else, so that's good. At least now. Yeah, I'm going to allow it. Yes. Um, and then I'm going to go for... It's my choice. Okay. Yeah. I have full agency in this situation. Okay. Before, I'm going to cast oh, Mangara the Diplomat. This is a lifelink 2 form. Whenever an opponent attacks with creatures, if two or more of those are attacking me and or planes because I control, I draw a card. When an opponent casts their second spell each turn, draw a card. Cool. Very cool, very cool. Um, I'm going to move to combat. I am going to simply try and take down some of Piper's border peg, go to combat. Balden will attack, Bremaz will attack, and I'll trigger Bremaz, trigger Balden. Balden will give them both plus four, plus zero, as uh, so a plus zero, plus four. So he's 11, and this one here is eight, eight. What's so my life total at? Who's? Mine. Your life total is at 33. What's mine at? 36? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Trent's at 40. I'm going to block E Honda. The bigger the E Honda, yep. Yep. That's fine. And I'm going to take Bremaz. All right. And then, the oh, there's also, there is also a 1-1 one, one coming at you. There's also a 1-1. One, one. I'll yeah. block that with a 2-2. Two, two. Okay, sure. So you take oh. the... Yep, that's fine. You take the 8 and you go down to 25. Yeah. That is yep, correct. I can do math. I'm proud of you, buddy. Thanks. All right. Well, that was fun and thick and, and smelling good. Um, and then we'll go to Pipe's turn. Uh, before you draw, I will attempt to cast Silence! Your opponents can't cast spells this turn. Narcissus Reversal. 
Okay, back to my hand. Yeah. <laughs> I will in response attempt to silence. But I create a target, right? Yeah, like in I response to... Oh, it bounces, then you resolve it, right? Oh, yeah, yeah I guess so. So, right. no. Okay, yeah. you are correct. Sorry. I thought it was... I thought it I bounced mine and then attempt to copy it. My bad. I thought it made a copy on the stack. I didn't really copy, target, instant, or sorcery cast spell, then return it to its owner's hand. You so there's no way. Targets, yeah. yeah. Oh, resolve and then bounce back. Yeah, there's no chance. Yeah. Go ahead. Right. No, that's fine. That, that was my best option. So <laughs> Now you're all grand abolished. I guess. Cool. Is silence spells and abilities or just spells? Spells. Can't cast spells. That's all it is. Yeah. Unfortunately, I still don't like. I still don't have Magnus on board, so it's still rough. Yeah, you can do some cool stuff, but we'll see what happens. One, yeah. two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You'd be down to one mana left if you cast him. Yeah. Which is one, and then X is eight, possibly. That's still something. I, did, I just need one more land to drop because then I could do this and then cast him and still have yeah. these to. But I don't have a land. No. Which is quite unfortunate. Oh, so you can just level that up and then do that yeah. anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can, yes. See, so yeah, I think... It would present quite a problematic situation. I'm sure it would. Mm, it would indeed. Many such cases. I'm going to... I am going to level it up. Yeah, that makes sense. Man, Sorcerer class is so crazy, It's man. so good. It's so good. Like, is it just got Crippleth right? Yeah. And then I can... We have Crippleth right at home. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, just, seven, eight. Oh, Wait. It's crazy. Izix of the... Uh, no. Niv Nivix of the Ismagus? Mizix of the Ismagus. of the Ismagus. It's like, I want Crippleth right. Yeah. Please give me Crippleth right. Once you can play um, fair and balanced magic. Mm, yes. <laughs> Actually storms out like a boss. <laughs> <laughs> Tristani at home. This is me when I when my opponent Nasa reversals my silence. <laughs> it's pretty funny. I thought it, I thought You're it was loud, a really good name. No noise. Yeah. Two, three, four. Five, I have no mouth and I must scream. Six. Here we go. And it cost a locust god. Yep. Yay! Ooh, I will draw a card except your second spell. Yay! I wonder what that card was. <laughs> Get out of here with that. This is interesting. Five is in a very dangerous position. Mm. It's very us. it's very interesting. I'm just this is this is this deck is too galaxy brain for me. It is a big galaxy brain, but you're doing well. I'm trying no, my have, damnedest. You have um, the unstable lands, not the unfinity. Oh, dude. Oh, yes, everyone. Can we Ed, cut that Ed, out? Ed, clapping, add in the clapping effect. Yeah, yeah. 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 Just, just cut to me, Connor. Oh, sounds kind of sad, yeah. Three, kind of sad. four, five. That joke's for you. <laughs> <laughs> everyone at home, that joke's for you. One, two, three. Sorry, do you mind if I read this? Yeah. This can you read this? <laughs> no. So you can't tap it for mana, right? I can convoke with it. Though. You can, though. Oh. I can convoke with it. Well. Continue. No, I'm just... I'm sorry, I'm just thinking. I'm just trying to figure out what the best course of action is. Do the locusts have haste? No, it's... No. But they're trying to go convoke. It doesn't have haste. Yeah. No, no, no. I mean the locusts they create. They do have oh, haste. Yes, they do. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah absolutely. One moment, flying haste. What is everyone life totals at right now? 40. And James on 36. Yeah, it's been, it's been interesting. Big walls to get through. Okay, so I'm going to... Well, when you have 40 one, one flying haste locusts, yeah, it, it be, doesn't really matter. Yeah, it can be pretty Still interesting. Still two turns. It can yeah. be pretty interesting. You're right. You know what? It can be pretty interesting. So mm -hmm. I'm going to... Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to tap one of these. Yep. And I'm going to complete the circuit. Yep. So I may cast sorcery spells that had they had flash, and when I next cast an instant sorcery spell this turn, I may copy it twice and choose new targets for those copies. Thank you. And another one of these bad boys. Yep. And also, the locust god gives me a no when you draw a card. when I draw cards. That's right. That's the next one. That's the next. That's bid. the next card. <laughs> That's the next bid. But wait, there's, there's more. There's more. But the elementals don't have haste, so that's important. 
The elementals do not have eight, no. But I've still got one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. Seven. Yes. Yes. Uh, so I'm going to then tap all seven for occult epiphany. Draw X cards, discard X cards, and create a 1-1 one, one, uh, white spirit creature token with flying for each card type. A monk cast discarded this way. Okay. So I cast that three times. So you draw six, then you discard six, you draw six, you discard six, you draw yes. six, you discard six. And I make three times six, 18. 18 one more flyers. 18 one more flyers, which all have yes. haste, which means I can tap them for mana. Yep. So. Two, three, four, five, this is not good. Six? No. No. <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> so I'm going to discard. Oh my god. I'm not even worried about the attacking one, things. I'm just worried about two. like the crackle and fuck flame or crackle with power. Two, three, They did all this without Magnus anyway. Mm. Like it doesn't even. Four. Are they insects or locusts? Yes, insect. Yeah, I don't think they're actually called locusts in any way. That's why I was confused. And you make a bunch of flying spirits that, while they don't have haste, you know, are on the battlefield. Yep. Mm. <sighs> this is this is rough. Uh, five, six. So then I have. Sorcery, sorcery, creature, land, artifact. That's it. Sorcery, land, creature, artifact. Bug. Yeah. Cool. Sorcery, land, creature, oh. artifact. So then I make. Okay. So I make another four spirits. Yep. Those we have to explore. I feel like the game is now officially over, right? I think it is. Because you just discarded past in flames. Yeah. And you have um, the X draw card spell. Yeah. And you have that many tokens that can tap for it. Yeah. You can make Ooh. that many tokens again that'll okay, continue. Yeah. We'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get there. I think we're going to actually get there now. I think I think we might actually do it. How many spirits do you make? Uh, uh, I, made, I made four just then, but we're going <laughs> to make more. But wait, there's more. And it doesn't even matter what I discard anymore because I have past in flames in the discard, right? Really? Well, the cards you discard are going to just be more cards for past in flames too. Yeah. Get casting again, and so I'm gonna oh, discard. But you'll make more spirits. I'll make more spirits. Oh, you discard spell twine, will ya? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Two. Oh. Three. <laughs> oh, it's crack with power. Isn't that yeah. lethal? That's got to be lethal, right? Just leave that in your hand. Oh yeah, that just is. Leave that in yeah. your hand and just cast it. Is that lethal? I think it is. Yeah. Right, right. If you have 18, put 18 as the crack with power right now for me. Like, doesn't matter. Let's just say whatever else keeps happening. Yeah. What is 18 in a crackle of power? It's 15 at the X. 16 to the X, so 15 to the X, right? Yeah. 15, it's 3. 5, 5, 5. So it's 5 times 5 to each of up to 5 targets. Yep. Okay, so not quite lethal not yet. Not quite lethal just yet. we gotta, we got to right, do a little bit more. we got to do a little bit more. I'm, so, I'm so sorry. No need for apologies, man. You're doing great. But you want to keep that message in your hand, right? Because you can tap all your spirits for it. Yes. The spirits are white flies, though, so you need blue mana at least. But still. I just need to make sure that I have three cards left in hand. That's like... Does Past and Flames give X spells X as their flashback cost? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's crazy. I, I can just discard X zero. So one, two... It's not their converted mana cost, right? Three? It just gives them flashback? It doesn't actually say it anything about mana cost. cost. Oh, then maybe not. Uh, no, no, it's... Yeah, not converted mana cost, right? It's mana cost. I'm, I'm feeling pretty, pretty sure safe that does give X to flashback. Because yeah. you're all silenced this turn, so I am going to discard Fist yeah. Guardianship and uh, Swan Song. Yeah, I kind of I kind of does with the whole silencing them. Yep. Oh well. We tried. I think that was still a good option. <laughs> I, mean, I had no card in hand. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to matter about it anyway, yeah. I guess so. Yeah. I guess so. <laughs> I can ping and then I'm just going to discard all the six, the six cards that I just drew for this one, because... They're fundamentally useless. Yeah. Did you count your cards there for the spirits because you have like invoke and such? Right. Yeah. Uh, yeah, if you cast an instant, yeah, yeah it gives them X. Because you're not converted. If it was converted, I think then it would be. Yeah. So it's instant sorcery creature. So three more. And then we have land enchantment creature instant. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. Who needs these happy death things? things? Silenced, right? Yeah. And then you can go tap three of these, and then tap all of these to yeah. use uh, that. They don't have haste. They have, it has Convoke. This has Convoke. 
It's oh. from, it's from yeah. March of the Machine, where every card has Convoke. Yes. So I'm going to tap four of these, and then the rest of these. So four down here. And then all of these get tapped. So you draw yeah. 11 cards. Yes. Which will make an 11, 11 more hasty boys. More hasty boys. So uh, you have 11. So one, two, and that You just put 12 on this. And I'm going down by one. Oh, OK. Sorry. Yeah, that's what Nine, I'm doing. 10, 11. You're good. Sorry, Jamin. There no, you go. I don't think it matters. Yeah, <laughs> it's true. It's true. Just how many cards? Now, wait, wait. So, crack of power. Uh, six, 12, 25. So, 25, right? Minus, f well, how much is it for the crackle power? Two? I just got mana geyser, so I think we're good. <clears throat> we can crackle with power. So, okay, so we passed in flames. We cast a spell that copies the mana geyser. Yeah. We then cast the mana geyser, right? Yeah. We then cast it again with past flames from the graveyard. And then you put all of it into Crackle with Power. And I'm sure that's enough, surely. You can't believe it three times. Well, let's, let's let the people at home really see how fortunate <laughs> this is. So, you cast Meta Geyser. Wait, how much? Okay, you know what else how many Tap Lands does everyone have? Wait, wait, you know what else we need to do at some point? Upgrade your sorcery class, sorcery class so you can start doming us for all the damage you're doing. Oh my god, you're right. Cool. Uh, eight. You have eight? How many? And I have um, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Oh. I'll tap one in response, eight. <laughs> cool. I could do that. Um, have another dice, please. Yeah. Alright, so you have 16 red You have eight, uh, sorry, yeah, 16 red metal. Yes. Yep, by tapping five of these. So. Yep. So we'll just fix this one up. And then we can. Then we can pass in flames. Yeah, then we can pass in flames. So pass in flames for four. You got 12 red left. Uh, the flashback is five. Sorry, flashback is five. Yeah. So oh, and we're making tokens, bro. Yeah, we're making tokens the whole time. They don't have haste. They have convoke. Convoke. Yeah. Convoke. <laughs> yeah. All right. So now you have eleven red mana. Now we have eleven red mana. Are you going to pay seven. another five for that? So yeah, we could pay another five. Or no, you want to do the um, uh, the convoke the, copy thing, right? The copy thing first. Yes. Complete the circuit. Yeah, I didn't go past it already. Complete the circuit. There it is. Oh. All right, and then we so do tap three for it. Yeah, tap three of these. Three, which leaves you with. You still need a blue metal. They're um, red and blue. They yeah. are red. They tap for red and blue. Yeah, as well. Oh, they tap for red and blue. Yeah. They both tap for red and blue and are red and blue. Yeah. <laughs> so you can convert them for blue. Yes. Anyway. Yes. So what? We'll put one more down here. So down one, and that's paid for four out of that. So then you take another two from here. Bam! You have nine red mana. And you've completed the circuit. I've completed and the circuit. Got and and I got one another one of those. Because you can't complete the circuit. Yeah. And then we flash back Mana Geyser. Which is five. Which is five. So three down to four. And then you make three times 16 mana. And then I make three times 16 mana. And then I put. Three and times 16 mana is 32, which is 48. 48. Yes, 48. And then 48 plus 18, 19. So 57. Yeah. Into crackle with into power. crackle with power. Well, this must hold, be up, correct. hold up. We've got to take two away for the, the yeah. red cost. That's fine. We're going to do that first. So fifty-five, right? Yeah. Overall, is the matter we have access to here. Fifty-five across three x. Uh, it's like ten, and it's five <laughs> times the amount. So it's at least ten per x. So I think that five targets take fifty plus damage. Well played, everyone. Yay! Well played, everyone. Yay! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Ah! Didn't even have Magnus works. on the board. <laughs> Didn't, even Didn't even have, have Magnus, Magnus on, on the board. board. That was all Locust God, baby. <sighs> just the keyword convoke, man. Just put on everything. Just put on everything. Right. Slap it on that bad boy. You guys read City on Fire as well? God damn, yep. man. If I didn't silence you, did you have a response at all? Like, if, if I didn't ask how to reversal the silence? No? I had another silence. <laughs> 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 I had silence, bro. I had mono white. Think about it. Well, I, um, I, you know what I did have? I was waiting for Dylan, right? What I did have was Entrapment Maneuver, which is sack and attack a creature, make X one ones. And then the problem was, like, I worried about the Nightmare Shepherd, forgetting you're on one. Um, and then those creatures were all, like, you know, six sixes, I guess, which is cute. Like, but then you made a 100 billion dillion dudes, and it's like, well. I also had Blue Suns in hand as well. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah. You also, by the way, you also had, um, Goblin War Party in your graveyard to cast and copy it, right? And yeah. you cast it in twine copy, it's plus yeah. three, plus three with haste on everything on your board. And there's also that option. Your deck is just, once passing place, it's the graveyard. 
It's all that was all bonkers. Over. Bonkers. That was it's all bonkers. Gravy. Whoa. I, I do want to apologize for how uh, no, long it was towards the end. We come, we come together. We come yeah. together as a team as a and cohort. we work out this this mess. mess. Because Look at what's, this. Re what's <laughs> really important is that the people at home know what happened there. Yeah. They, I'm sure they do. Now put in the comments if you really caught up with all of that. You know, James is right. I'm sick of the stack. I'm banning it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm banning the yeah. stack. I'm the done stack is it. boring and I hate New it. New enchantment. Stack no longer exists. I, I will Cards say, resolve immediately. I've never had silence been now set reversal, and that was very backbreaking. Like, I didn't have anything, but yeah. if I did, I would have been very upset still. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. Oof. I could have. Yeah, it sucks. I, you know what I could have done? I should have responded with holy dang, red all combat damage, and then died to crackle with power where X is a billion. <laughs> See, now you just, you just go wait for Lord of the Rings to come out, you know? Yeah, my friend. Because okay. then you have that one, that, that new white card that comes out in Lord of the Rings. Oh my gosh, what is that card? Yeah. Oh, do you see that? There's like an uncommon in Lord of the Rings, right? It's like one in a white, and it's return target spell to its instant. Return target spell to its owner's hand, draw a card. It's, it's an uncommon white instant. It's like the counter spell for white. It's yeah. bounce it back to your hand, and I draw a card. Which isn't like crazy, but the amount of times that it's insane is going to be Yeah, crazy. that's crazy enough. That's yeah. crazy enough. That's crazy enough. It's not Arcane Denial, but it's still crazy enough. Yeah. And you know what? Cards that can't be counted, you're just like, no, I'm going to put it back in your hand. Like Holebreaker Horror? Yeah, no, I'm going to put that back in your hand, draw a card. I really, liked, it. I really liked all these decks. Yeah. Like, Jamin constantly putting up like a, like a, I guess, like a control threat on the board stage. He was so close to taking the game out, I reckon. Yeah, and then that happened, and I just stopped caring. That's, that's the thing, right? I'm like, it hits to a point where I'm, I get, I get bored. I'm just like, I don't care anymore. <laughs> that's valid. That's, that's very play. valid. Yeah, yeah. It got to a point. I, it was my play, and I was bored. Yeah. Can we get this man on the rules committee? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I want this man on the rules committee. He's got the right idea. There's like a fun timer. It's, well, it's, it's the arena timer. It's just like no stop. Yeah, they won't stop. <laughs> no, no, yeah. I'm doing my thing. I, I don't care. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna. You're like waiting for the phase of turn. You're like Alt F4. Yeah, you're yeah. like a Terraria. <laughs> <laughs> doom, 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 no, just old tile and keep playing. Oh yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. That's true. That's true. Um, um, and then when they finished their turn, you roped them because that it was, was AFK. That was yeah. a that was a Yu-Gi-Oh turn right there. That's that, was was a Yu -Oh that, that, that was a Yu-Gi-Oh turn. That was straight Yu-Gi-Oh. I reckon. I reckon Magnus the Red would play Yu-Gi-Oh. I reckon he would. Yeah. I think I kiss you like Nurse Burn. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone gets that reference? We don't like that. Yeah, here. we don't talk about Nurse Burn. He's just there in the warp with one of those like dual discs. Dual discs. <laughs> it's time to duel. No, he's there on what is it called? Master duel. <laughs> yeah, Master Duel. Yeah. He's 41 activations later. <laughs> <laughs> what do you come here for, Lehman Russ? Yeah. <laughs> um, well, those are the decks we played in Universe Beyond. Let us know in the comments what decks you've been playing from the Universe Beyond series. There's plenty more coming out this year. Obviously, we have the full set with Lord of the Rings coming out. They just announced the Doctor Who decks. Yeah. Um, with some of the art. We don't know what the commanders are going to look like yet, but we know basically what they, the decks are. We do know that the uh, new mechanic for the Doctor's uh, companion, companion is like pseudo partner. It's like partner with, but you can bring any companion with any Doctor. It feels like that's what yeah, they're trying to do. Yeah, it matches a creature type. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't that know. was yeah. powerful. Yeah, that hurt a lot, actually. <laughs> yeah, I really yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> Magic elbow, I just fucking... Sorry, up. yeah. Oh. I felt your whole body like, yeah, shake yeah. from here. Um, but yeah, these, these decks were nuts. Um, I, I, I liked this a lot. I don't... I like mono white often anyway because it's a bit like a, a bit of a staple in the arm. <laughs> but it's like I, I don't mind it. Like this deck was really cool. I think it's you know it's a bit of a win condition in the command zone. I think maybe I need more cards that generate lots of creatures. I play those X make X one ones, but I like that this deck like presents itself as a meme, but is actually like the quintessential white weenies commander deck. It kind of is. Like cla like old school like early two thousands mono white deck. Mm -hmm. It reminds me of like, it's like reverse Darien, King of Keldor, where it's like Darien's your foot six mana commander that generates all the cards, and then you find a way to win with them, and in mono white, that can be pretty typical. Uh, but this is the other way around. Like, you have lots of ways in white to make the tokens. That's the easy part. It's turning them into a win condition that he helps with, which I really like. Yeah. Um, trample would have been very helpful. We can't have everything we want, you know what I mean? White can't have trample. What do you mean? White can't, that's a green ability. And black. And red. Sometimes blue. This is Leviathans, but not white. No, not white cards, <laughs> no. Oh, you can give him, um, what was it, non-basic land walk with an equipment, right? Yeah, I can give him that. There's, there's, I think, like, definitely, you there's a layer where you just play him as a Voltron commander, and then you have, like, seven cards, he's 14, you give him double strike, and you go, you die. Mm. Like, you know, there's, there's options like that Good as well. Yeah. It Riku, not Riku, um, the Bant guy. Uh, oh, yes, uh, Rafik the Many. Rafik the Many. Yeah, thank you for producing one. Rafik the Many, yes. Yeah, yeah, Josh's deck. Um, <laughs> but that has blue and green in it, so a little better. Cringe. It adds trample. It adds trample. And counterspell. And ramp. Sorry, continue. Wouldn't help you, you were silenced. 
That's true. I, I, I like also, the Narset's reversal. I also really dug uh, your deck, Jamin, with the the fact that it wasn't like just you, you were incentivized to not control the board state all at once. Yeah. You're incentivized to kind of like just do little bits of yeah, control. Bit, yeah, bit bit of busy turn. Yeah, it's all the sac- like one at a time sacrificing, right? Yeah, it wants yeah. you to do it because it, it triggers once per turn. You go like, oh, that's like a really nerfed ability because he'd be broken otherwise, right? Oh, and you're like, oh, that's a pretty nerfed ability. And then you go, oh, but now my deck is all about doing it everyone's turn. Yeah. And then being like a bit of a nuisance. Yeah, yeah. just um, like scratching at people. Yeah. Than, like, being a little goofer. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like my deck was held actually the most back by the fact that I was so worried about attrition the whole game. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. yeah, that's fair. Because I was like, if I present too much of a threat, like I had cards in my hand that I could use that would present like creatures. I had 100 handed one in my hand for so long. And it's format to play te- uh, six mana to monsters as well as saying, I was like, this can't be worth 10 mana. It gets attritioned. <laughs> it's like, yep, <laughs> that was cool. So. Well, if you want to uh, play, if you want to pick up cards for your decks as well, don't forget to go to TCG singles.store. Use the discount code VGLIVE to get 5% off your order or Leyline to get 10% off your order. Uh, and if you want to see your more. First order. Yeah, sorry, your first order. Um, <laughs> and if you want to see more um, commander content from us here, don't forget to click like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and get the bell on to get notified every time a new video goes live. Thanks so much for joining us today, Jamin. Yeah. Um, everyone can see you around at the Vault Brisbane store, hopefully. Uh, and thank you, Connor, behind the scenes. Thank you, thank Connor. You Connor. Thank you, Connor. Thank you, Say Connor. thank you, thank Connor, you, Connor, in the chat, everyone. Sorry, in the comments. Um, and thank you, too, oh. for still being here. And thank you, Piper, for teaching us, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like, yeah. Someone. We all learned someone today. Wa- yeah, someone watching this video learned something, yeah. I hope. I learned something. Um, it's stays- past in flames. Past and Flames. Past, past and flames. flames, everyone. Past, past and flames. flames. If no one got me, I know Past and Flames got me. Can <laughs> Can I get an arm <laughs> All right, everyone. Stay safe. Wash your goddamn hands. We'll catch you next time. Bye. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, Jamin. Goodbye, Jamin. Goodbye, Jamin. Fade me out. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>